Okay, we are going to look at the Asus Vento 3600 gaming case. Uh, this is a mid tower case, and it's not the best case that money can buy right now at the market. Uh, but the thing is, it looks really good. I mean, it has this glossy finish, and it comes in four different colors uh, black, red, blue, and green. I have the black one here for this review, and I have been using this for quite a while, so I'm gonna give you uh, tips about the pros and cons of this uh, casing okay now we are looking at the front panel of the Asus Vento 3600 gaming casing and when we go right down you will find four USB ports two on top and two on bottom and microphone jack headphone jack and when you move right on top of that you will find the power button where it glows in white when you turn it on and on the sides on the left and right hand sides there are two ventilation holes for cool air to be taken inside the casing and uh, there are two plastic flaps where a uh, white LED is attached so when it's powered on it will glow in white and look, looks really nice when it's turned on and on top uh, there is a this part this whole thing can be opened up and inside you will find four five and a quarter inch base and one three point five inch base where you can install a floppy drive or else a, a hard disk and looking at the side of the casing you can see the Asus logo is embedded and it looks really nice I would say and there's a small lever where you can rotate to open up the side panel okay uh, when we look at the inside of the casing uh, you will find four five and a quarter inch base and uh, underneath you can install two hard drives uh, and this is completely removable you can take it out and install your hard drives and put it back in like so and on top of that you have the uh, 3.5 inch bay where you can install a floppy drive or a hard drive and one thing to notice is that uh, all the expansion slots are tool, uh, it's all toolless where you can uh, mount in or remove uh, without using any nuts or screws and on the back of the casing you have a 120 millimeter exhaust fan and on bottom of that you have seven expansion slots these all are toolless by the way uh, and you have all the front panel connectivities you can connect into the motherboard and this is the left air intake this comes with the casing where uh, from the front vent which I showed you earlier it will take cool air and the right air intake fan I have installed it uh, it doesn't come with the casing when you buy it originally uh, but you can always uh, include a 80 millimeter fan to intake cool air into it and this is the motherboard tray which is designed for a ATX form uh, factor motherboard and on top of that you have the uh, power supply bracket and one thing to notice about this casing is that um, the hard drives are faced to the back of the casing and the thing is when you install long graphic cards uh, like uh, GTX uh, 295 or GTX 260 285 or any latest graphic card that are uh, about 10 inches in width the it will be a tough job to uh, mount the hard drive plugs to the hard disks I mean your power cable and the SATA cable it will definitely interfere with the uh, graphic card and it it will make your life miserable so uh, that's something that you will have to keep notice of and also uh, when you look at the back there is a wire management back cover which is removable you can either keep it or completely remove it 
and this is where the motherboard IO shield plate will get installed well overall talking about the Asus Vento 3600 gaming casing even though it's a very eye-catchy and good-looking casing I would not recommend to the high-end users because uh, the most latest uh, graphic cards such as uh, GTX 295, uh, 280, 285 and even the 9800 GTX when you install them it will definitely interfere with the hard drive connectivity and uh, it may not seem very feasible to uh, plug them all in but if you find out a way to plug the hard drives in then you are good to go this casing will definitely look great on your table or in your setup so it's a very good looking casing but if Asus would have built it with bit more space on it this would have been a really great casing well, thank you for watching our Square video reviews. Hoping to see you next time with a new video review. Thank you.